<coughs> hey guys, I am up. Um, it's Friday. Sorry about the wind. Get out of the wind. Um, yeah, I've got the uh, 1.10 update on the legend. Uh, let's go detecting. Sorry, right, okay, we're using the legend. Uh, it's a 1.10 beta update. Uh, first time I'm using it on soil. I tried it on sand in the storm the other day. It's a bit quieter today. Uh, I'm in custom mode. On uh, field mode. Uh, done recovery speed 5. <coughs> I'm not going to play around with a bottle cap. The new bottle cap edition. I'm just going to keep go with, go as it is multi two and uh yeah we'll just see how it goes okay first uh, target uh, had a vdi of 26 it's a bit chattery and uh, the on the ferrous scale it'll say ferrous and non-ferrous either way so and it's clearly a button with nothing on it but still not a bad start. Right, next target. It's just here. Looks coin shaped. Uh, had a VDI of 33. It's got some green on it. I'm saying that. I've known it to be buttons like that before. Uh, it does look like a coin. It's possibly a coin anyway. Sorry for more sniffly. Uh, looks like it might be too toasted. I can see part of a bust on it though, and some writing. That's Victoria. That's a very beaten up Victoria halfpenny. Right, next up, VDI 25. I initially thought it was going to be a piece of lead. Oh, look at that buckle and a little bit of leather stuck to it. Just come off of my hands. That's kind of cool. Right, this one, VDI 24. Tiny little button. I can see a little pattern on there, but I dare say I won't get too much detail off it. Right, next target, VDI 23. That's uh, a button. Just a plain old flat pewter button. Still nice to find, I like finding buttons. Happy with that. All right, this uh, belter of a signal, this one. Uh, VDI 46. Is it a coin? It feels like one. Yeah, it's a big old coin. I can't... I don't want to rub it too much. Okay. It's quite thick. Possibly from George III era. But we won't know until we clean it and see if we can get any more details. Alright, next target, VDI 33. Bit of a bridle ring. Not a bit of a, it is a bridle ring. Well, there's no need to dig this one. 
on the surface. Tiny little budson. Right. Is that a VDI 19 for the low toad? I nearly didn't dig it up. Doesn't look like a button, but it's very brittle. I don't know. Iron coin? No idea. Uh, I'll wait until I can get it to clean it up. You never know, it might be something good. Alright, next target VDI 29. Little pistol shot. Very nice. Right, next target. 33. What the hell is that? Yeah. Oh, oh, it's very floppy. I think this might be a... <laughs> this might be a milk bottle top. One of the old ones. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I think that's what it is. Yeah, it's just a bottle top. <laughs> I should have used the bottle cap setting. <laughs> oh well. Had a little bit of rain then. Okay. What's that? What's that thing? Uh, this one was a uh, 46. It's a coin. Oh, I just dropped it again. Ah, we have a date. Look at that. 1880. Six. So Victoria Penny. Happy with that. Queen Victoria. God, temperatures drop suddenly. Okay, so I got whatever this is. It's a VDR twenty seven. Yeah, no idea what that is. It's obviously snapped off something. All right, it's a uh, twenty-nine and shown on the screen. Yeah, it looks looks really old. Something on it. I'll have to wait to clean that up. Yeah, it's very old. Okay. Well, 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 I couldn't resist. I couldn't resist. I had to get the toothbrush on it gentle. That there, is it 1689? I think it was. Uh, King James the Second gun money. Ha <laughs> ha! That is definitely off my bucket list now. Uh, I took some photos and sent them off to um, Team Unearthed, and Graham very kindly identified it for me. So thank you, Graham. That has definitely made my my whole week. Very poorly, <laughs> and that has really, really has cheered me up. Yeah, it's a bit worse for wear, but hey, that's one off my bucket list. Woohoo! <laughs> right then, this VDI of 26 looks like a coin. Yeah, it's 
something on it. I don't know. I'll have to wait for the clean up for that one. It's definitely a coin though. Alright, this is a like a handle or something. Everything. Came up with 56. Yeah. There you go. Alright, there's a target. Uh, this one is a 45. Uh, ah, pewter button. Uh, nice. I reckon I'll be calling it a day soon, folks. It's a little button, pewter button. Look at this thing. It's surface find. It was partially buried, at least. This was rung up a 50. It's a great big piece of lead. Is it lead? I think it is. Yeah. Big thing of lead. It's like a pot. Maybe, I don't know. That's odd. Oh, I'll clean it up uh, tomorrow on the video. We'll have a closer look. Right, folks, I'm calling it a day. Uh, not fully recovered, and I don't know if I'm shouting, but I've burst my eardrums. So I'm a right mess. But I've got to keep going out, uh, getting my body ready for work on Monday. So, anyway, stop grumbling. Uh, I found some cool stuff, found a bucket lister today. I'll do my cleanup video tomorrow. Um, yeah, so thank you very much. If you've just happened to come across me, please consider subscribing and give this video a thumbs up. It does help me get recognised. Um, and I appreciate all of your support. Nearly at 1,100 subscribers, so thank you very much to everybody. Uh, I will be having a giveaway once I reach that target. Uh, so please share me and tell people to subscribe ask people to subscribe and leave a comment on videos um, when I do reach that target I'll there'll be a, a honeymoon period where I'll, I'll sit on it then I'll do the announce a giveaway prizes to be confirmed probably some silver and maybe some other bits I don't know uh, thank you very much I shall see you on the next one